Hey guys, a Battlefield 4, part 4. And this time we are playing with 8 gigs of RAM and GTX 660. And I'm doing those tests just to prove you that no matter what you do, no matter how many gigs of RAM you will add, no matter what graphic card you will add, this 8 log 5350 is not capable to handle it. So I recommend to just use 4 gig of RAM and integrate this graphic card. Don't add anything. This is not a gaming device, and this is our best test so far. Why? Because the game went crazy. It went absolutely nuts. There are moments in the games when I actually thought that I'm that I might be wrong. That I have resolution of full HD and high details, even unanalyzing this by four, and I keep like 40 FPS, 35. I was like, hmm, I might be wrong, and then <laughs> something funny happened. I was pushing some buttons, like just go forward and left, right, and moving the mouse and trying to do something, and he just do everything else. I mean, what the hell is going on? What the hell? I just stopped pushing any buttons, and he is still doing something. I mean, running around, and but then I realized what is going on. The graphic says yes. We want to go this FPS and we want to go with the settings, but the CPU is like, no, no, Ace, you are too local. We need to slow down. I cannot keep up. I mean, it's it's horrible. There is so big conflict between CPU and GPU that they just cannot co op, at least in that game. And this is the result. The graphic want to go further, but the CPU is not following. In the end, we just have huge mass and it's impossible to play. If you press, I don't know how many times I press some buttons and do something, uh, let's say I hit them 100 times, he stops doing those comments after 30 seconds. It took him 30 seconds to end what I was pushing in like, I don't know, 3 seconds. So that's how bad it is. So if you want to have a media computer, yes, this device, it was made for media. If you want to have a gaming computer, no, this is not a gaming computer. So I think I sold a gaming performance of this computer for once and for all. And thanks for watching and I will see you in the next movies.